My name is Michael Gerken and I'm a researcher e-learning at the Department of Educational Research and Development. And the speed assignments are quick critical thinking activities. So it's a really short assignment that students uh, can take in, I don't know, half an hour, something like this. So really a short critical thinking assignment. Students writing the master thesis here at SPE, they can encounter certain difficulties or challenges. And one of those challenges is that they have to find a topic in the beginning and also a problem statement. So, so narrow the topic, that which is kind of brand marketing, I want to do something brand marketing, narrow it down to a certain problem statement, what I'm going to actually do in this master thesis. And the project was about that we wanted to assist students in finding a topic and a certain problem statement with an online course. We created a Facebook page, um, a private group, so it's closed. And you would go, you would sign up, you would go online, and then uh, the speed assignments, the duration was six weeks, and every Monday you would get a new assignment posted in Facebook. And you could interact on it on Facebook and chat with the other students who are also in the same group. The first assignment was that we uh, said to students now, go and find two newspaper items on a topic you're interested in, two recent newspaper items. So they can Google, whatever, and can post it on Facebook. And the next assignment was that we said, now, now you go and find someone who's an expert in your field or in your topic, can be a researcher, but can also be a manager, and conduct a little interview with them. Not, not long, but only, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes. And just ask him, what's the, what's the main reason for your topic? What's the problems within your topic you like? And what's going on in there? What's, what's the trends? What's the recent news? In, in the end, it's kind of that you exchange your knowledge with people not on the same topic, but more and more related in the same, the same master. And that you, it, by sharing your things, what you find, that other people also get, start thinking about oh yeah, this is interesting what you found, maybe I can do something in this direction. So it's more the, the knowledge sharing online. In the beginning it was uh, good, and then the, um, so there was activity online, but then the departments decided that they changed the procedure, or have a new procedure, and giving, by giving students a topic, a problem statement, and a database. So then there was silence because students felt like, yeah, now I got a topic from a supervisor and I don't need this course anymore, which is obvious.